hello folks and welcome to another Adams tutorial today we'll be doing the simulation of a double pendulum this will be in continuation from the single pendulum uh, if you haven't watched that video I'd recommend you go watch it we will learn how to do a construction of a double pendulum in Adams then we'll trace the endpoint of the double pendulum as it shows a chaotic behavior so we'll observe the behavior for different kind of initial conditions it's gonna be fun so let's get started alrighty so the single pendulum is done now let's go to the double pendulum so we'll add another link and another bob to make this as a double pendulum let's go to bodies again uh, we'll add link I'll directly click select marker 2 here we go I'll just keep it straight again Okay, and another bob, 25 centimeter radius, 24 mm. Sorry, I'll add it to this part, which is part three. Add here. Okay, so I also need to define the initial joint condition for joint 2. Uh, I will just put this to, this will be 0 0.0. So, rotational displacement. I will put this to about minus, uh, what is it? 10. Okay. And this one I think was. Let's go to simulation. Let's just check everything is okay. How it works? Mm, all right, looks good. Just, just check it once again. Yep. I'll just increase this angle a bit more. Okay, here we have now uh, what we'll do is that we are going to trace the path of the pendulum all right so we'll go to simulation control uh, here animation controls you have this tracing so we'll add a trace marker we will trace the end marker 9 just just play it let us also observe the uh, chaotic motion of a double pendulum for that you can observe that I have changed the length of the second pendulum to actually increase uh, decrease the time period of oscillation uh, you can simply uh, you know go to the individual markers and then modify the location of the markers to decrease or increase the length over here or the other way can be to use a design variable for which I have already made a video earlier all right so let us do the simulation and try to observe what are the results when there's the chaotic motion of a 2d of pendulum uh, I will put the simulation time to 5 seconds uh, about 250 steps I'll just put it on simulation okay look at the behavior now let us trace using the trace marker uh, we can just browse it I will use the pendulum to center of mass marker which is basically the end point okay let us trace it uh, animation forward here we go hmm. 
beautiful pattern isn't it so this is the kind of chaotic motion that's being developed that's generated by a double pendulum let's change the initial position uh, connections join to I'll modify this okay uh, I'll make it even steeper uh, this is minus 60 degrees okay and this one minus uh, let's start at 30 degrees okay okay let's simulate this hmm. looks very chaotic changing its path now let's see what it shows when you trace it ah, beautiful pattern isn't it nature is so lovely okay folks so that's it for today's video uh, i hope you enjoyed it uh, we'll meet again in the next tutorial of adams until then take care and peace